This is the Onion News Network, telling you what we want you to know. Every day, millions of Americans eat out at restaurants where seemingly nice waitresses charm and enchant them with their warm smiles and playful small talk. But are these waitresses truly nice, or are they using their feminine wiles to manipulate you, the customer, into leaving larger tips? We decided to put one subject to the test, Lindsay Kolb. Lindsay happens to work at the cafe I frequent often. She always appears to be exceedingly attentive to me and consistently remembers the way I take my coffee. But does that mean she thinks our relationship is special? Or is this how she treats every customer who sits at one of her tables? The Special Investigative Undercover Response Team decided to find out. Our surveillance team installed dozens of hidden cameras inside the restaurant to gather as much data as possible. When I entered the restaurant, Lindsay seemed eager to see me. Hey there, you're back from more torture. What torture? The food. Oh, a joke. <laughs> But when I took a quick reading of her body temperature using the seared heat meter, it was not elevated like mine was. Our body language analyst informed me later that the way Lindsay casually clasped her hands in front of her was indicative of sexual interest. However, just 11 minutes after taking my order, Lindsay reproduced the same posture for this person, as well as this brutish looking truck driver who managed to stall her at his table for a full 22 seconds longer than me. Confusing? Yes. Very, very confusing. We finally decided to deploy two undercover operatives to infiltrate the staff and procure concrete data on the matter. Hey, uh, do you really know that customer out there with the blue shirt on? Yeah, Gavin. He's a regular. I think he's into you. You like him? Who are you? Are you new? Where's Tom? I'm Tom. Clearly, she was stonewalling us. So we decided to follow Lindsay to her home. After rendering Lindsay unconscious with the powerful sleeping gas we pumped in through the heating vents, our Seer team found no clear evidence that she had a husband or boyfriend. We'll keep an eye on Lindsay and her type until we find out why she won't return phone calls when she's not seeing anyone. For the Special Investigative Undercover Response Team, I'm Gavin Fisher.